This past summer, the opportunity of traveling the Karakoram Range presented itself to me. I immediately said yes and cleared everything from my schedule from June till August. My trip began in Calgary, Alberta, where I flew to Boston and met my two climbing partners. And we headed as a team to London, to Bahrain, finally to Islamabad, Pakistan. Once we were in Islamabad, we would drive up the Karakoram Highway to Skardu, and finally ending in the Fouché Valley. Shade, we would set off on foot into the Cherokusa Valley where we would establish our new home for the weeks to come at K7 Base Camp. Before any of this could happen though, there are weeks of planning in advance. Permits, visas, gear lists, food lists, packing, checking our lists, repacking, rechecking our lists, and finally checking ourselves and all of our food and gear at the airport. Once we arrived in Islamabad, we claimed the baggage that showed up and hit the road. The Karakoram Highway runs for 800 miles from Islamabad over the 15,000 foot pass on the Chinese border. It passes through the densest concentration of 7,000 meter peaks in the world and it is this dramatic contrast with the surrounding peaks towering over the Indus and later Hunza valleys far below which make the KKH so special. Because of the steep loose slopes at any point along the mountainous stages of the KKH, landslides frequently block the road. As we discovered, when a bridge was missing and we were forced to find another way around. When we finally arrived in Boucher, we unloaded all of our gear, repacked it for our quarters, and headed into the Cherokusa Valley the following morning. Our hike into base camp would require two full days. At the end of the first day, we discussed with our group of porters where we would stay the first night and continue on from there. Fida, is, well, it does not matter, but tomorrow we go to the base camp. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. Okay. So tonight is no problem. Yeah, but here we then, stay here. Is tomorrow is is longer day. Yeah, yes. longer day. Yeah, yeah. So it's better to go a little, little more today because yeah. it's only noon. Yeah, they put So you you stay here. That night, our porters would give us live entertainment, and in the morning we would finish our hike to K7 Base Camp. From there our climbing adventures would finally begin.